unbelievably gutted to not be able to do a full presentation right. as you come into the main shows of the night. Yeah. But um, hey, if that means you guys love it and you've got it home, yeah. there are just, like say, them few hundred left over. Let me ask you real quick, the, the last dies that we were showing you, can yes. they go through a Gemini uh, Junior? Yes, they can. Okay. You notice I use the Junior plates through the big Gemini to yeah. see you can use them both. Perfect. Right? Okay. This I'm so excited we about. We gave you a sneak peek. There is auto <laughs> ship available. I'm just going to tell you now, please get the auto ship. This is your Gemini Expressions pop out word dies and this. um and so we've got this the this a couple different options for you but no you you get the whole you get all of them oh, so in right. the set you get the thank you you oh, also yeah. get best wishes right we then also get with love Ooh. So here's your with love here. And can you see each time your card's going to fold flat. Yeah. It's all about having that surprise pop up in the center. And then the last set is your, of course, we couldn't have a collection oh, yeah. without a happy birthday in, right? Mm -hmm. Look at how clever these are. They fold flat to go in your card yeah. and pop up. Now, what I would say is we have designed this concept and we've designed a whole collection of words. And what we've done is instead of, instead of it being too much, putting every word you could want out there now, right. we've given you the four that you need and then with the order ships if you look at the order ship program you still get the special pricing that we've got today and you can basically pick and choose and add your extra words so can you see if you go for the order ship the next ones available to you are going to be in December okay. with the I love you ready for Valentine's Day mm -hmm. and your special friend one then oh could you call me for Valentine's Day now as you keep going through the next set is your well wishes which is coming in February you're well done and your good luck mm -hmm. then we move through so that's through February April. you're going to yeah. miss March in the April one you're going to move through into the just for you and it's your day. Nice. Then after April, it's going to be mid-June. June. Yeah. In June, you're then going to get the party and the hip hip array. Mm. And then the last one, July, August, August I think. Yeah. Oh, no, there's two more. August, yes. you get missing you and thinking of you. Mm -hmm. And then and September, the, and then the yeah, October, then oh, just to say birthday wishes. Oh. Right? So you get all of them. But right? I'll tell you this. If you want the auto ship, you do have to order it today. This is the only way that you can get those other sentiments. You're not going to be able to buy them separately, and you're not going to be able to buy them after we present this set. So you do have to go ahead and get these today. The <laughs> auto ship will be $17.95. That's it. That's, I mean, that's it for the two. For the two. They should be like um, $12.95 per die oh set. Oh my gosh. $14.95 for the big ones. Now, I'm going to show you how they work. You will absolutely be blown away, right? Okay. When you see the die set, you think, what on earth is going on here? Nobody needs to worry about that because we've done all the worrying in the engineering for you. Now, when you see over on the front, can you see it's got two little notches, right? Mm -hmm. Those little notches are what are going to line up with the inside of your card. So, to get this card, card ready okay you're going to have the outside of your card and then we want to cut the thank you into essentially the insert so what I've done is I've just taken a piece of beautiful paper I've put I don't know if you can see it I've put my little score lines not all the way along but I've just put them I'll show you on the on the planar side can you see you can just yes. see where we've got those little score lines on yeah. so what I'm going to do is I'm going to line up the little notches over those score lines okay. and again just hold it in place with a little bit of tape right so you don't want too much tack on your tape but you don't want this moving as it goes through okay. right now I'm going to send it through the Gemini uh, I'm going to use the junior plates but send it through my Gemini so that you can see that all of these can work with either the junior okay. or the big Gemini okay so we send it through it does all of the die cutting in one pass through and what it does is it puts the score lines in the clever places as well as all of the cut lines now I will tell you these are incredibly complicated to engineer and plan through however that is not your problem mm -hmm. that was my problem <laughs> we've already thought about all of that right? right so can you see as this comes through oh I've knocked my die a little bit but you'll get the idea because I'll have my other I'll have my other one can you see if we just fold these back you're going to fold all of the score lines that we've got yeah. onto here right mm -hmm. and then we're going to fold these score lines upwards now you don't have to do it back to front upside down for the camera you will be pleased to hear you can just fold yours the regular way okay. um, but it, ju it just makes it easy if I can try and show the camera what I'm doing okay so can you see uh, when they f this folds in we go one way and then the other way and basically all the front parts oh. on your design yeah. fold through so we're going to go one way and then we're going to go the other way with my thank okay. so that the thank you you can just see it all oh, starting yes. to stand up there yeah so can you, you can see, see that starting right to stand up 
right? Now, obviously, I just I just knocked my die a little bit in. Let me show you the one that I'd done where we just put that uh, fold through. Mm -hmm. So here it is where I hadn't knocked the die, and the thank you just kind of stands forward that little bit. Yes. And then all you're going to do is you're going to take your card and you're going to put your uh, little bit of glue onto here, and then it will just go and sit perfectly inside the card. And then what I like to do to make these really, really stand proud and stand upwards is once I got them in, notice I used the uh, the the, uh, the glue that had maneuverability. Yes. So that if I didn't quite get it in the right place the first oh, time, I, yeah. I can maneuver that into place. Now, it's a little bit hard to see the thank you, right? Okay. Take your die, run it through again on a piece of blank cardstock mm -hmm. and then just cut away at the tops of all the letters where you've got the fold lines can you mm -hmm. see so just cut that away so what i've done is i've essentially taken the thank you oh yeah and you i've just made it, it so i've just put it through the xyron yeah so that it's nice and sticky and then this thank you will just then go over the front of here oh. and really make it pop oh, out right my God. so that is just what shows you that real true and that folds flat this is what you've got to understand folds completely flat to go in the card yeah opens up and gives you that incredible 3D element to work. I mean, look at that. Oh right? my gosh. And then to be honest, I wouldn't be worrying about doing an awful lot to the front of the card because right. no one's ever going to see it. Yeah. The card is going to be displayed like this. That is beautiful. Isn't that beautiful? So, you get the thank you. Yes. Let me show you all the designs, yes, right? Yes, let's do it. You get the thank you, you get happy birthday, you get with love, and you get best wishes. So I've tried to think, I'm setting you off with the four designs that you're going to use 90% of the time, I would say, to get you going. Okay. Then if you're looking at that auto ship program, you've got the option to be able to be going and getting for 17 right. the next pairs of two every couple of months when they come out. And remember, so you're, you're starting off with four. If you want the auto ship, this is the only way you can get it on auto ship. You can't you can't get them separately, but I will tell you you can sign up for auto ship and then if you decide you want to skip a shipment or, or mm -hmm. something, you can do that. But the only thing is you can always opt out. You can't opt in. This is the time you have to make the decision. But you don't, your first shipment won't come on the auto ship until December. So you get these home, you order them today, you're gonna get these four sets home now. You start using them, you fall in love with them. And then you say, I'm so glad I got the auto ship. Or if you say, gosh, December's too soon, it's gonna be a busy month for me, I'm just gonna opt out of December. Okay, yep. but you can still carry on with the next, the February shipment would be after that. Um, we're gonna show you again how fast this is because these, I tell you, these are, I mean, this is this is the kind of thing that when you make a card like this, you're gonna be proud of yourself. Yes, <laughs> and do you know what I loved is, I had, I'd seen someone do this paper cut by hand. Oh my, how by long hand. Did that take? And I look and I think, I, and it must have been an engineer who'd worked out how to do this. Oh and I was gosh. like, that is one clever engineer. And I've literally had to have, we really lucky now that we have engineers work on our payroll. I've had yeah. them sit and work out how to do this oh so that we could also make it possible and yeah. doable for just regular people at home. Now, this is the only, I wouldn't say complicated, but only fiddly bit, right? Okay. You're going to just fold this, and I want you to just take your time and do it carefully. Not like Sarah when she's rushing on TV, <laughs> right? You can take your time and do yours carefully. So the fold lines at the outsides all go up, right? So can you see all these fold lines go up? And then the fold lines for your letters all come down. But the good news is they've got the score lines in there. Mm -hmm. So the score lines will literally just drop into place yeah. in front of your fingertips so that once you give them the little kind of crease to go with it, yeah. they just drop into place perfectly. So there's my with love, and then my base is gonna follow up, and I thought this was a lovely bit of a slightly different card to do, okay? Mm -hmm. So what we've done is, can you see with this one here? We've done that fold line, we've put the with love on there, and then all I've done is I've literally taken this extra piece that goes around yeah. and just sat it around kind the base framing. side here yeah. to really frame it. So you can see how we get that shaping. I mean, come on. Who would not want to do oh, that card? Wow. And you think it's going to go flat to go in the envelope. This is what yes. I love about it. It's flat to go in the envelope. Mm -hmm. Going to open up, and you've got a card with that built into the front. Oh, and I gosh. think that, uh, do you know, this might be one of my new favorite techniques in card making. I agree. I think I it's agree. just going to be right up there, which is why it's great to have that auto ship, because when you love it, yeah. next couple of months' time, you can yeah. do it with some more sentiments. This is my, my husband's totally getting the I love you one for Valentine's oh, Day. How when sweet. you get the December shipments. How's 
sweet. Go ahead and pick yours up. Remember, this is the single ship. If you want auto ship, you will get two more coming, uh, and there will be six total shipments of auto ship. Enjoy.